الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أهل السنة والجماعة are the people of justice and the people of a middle course and a middle path. And this is from the fadl of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made Ahl Sunnah between the two camps, if you would say, so to speak. Between those people who are extreme and those people who are too easy to, to throw away the principles of Ahl Sunnah people Jama'ah and compromise the people of Bid'ah and Zambaka. And so Ahl Sunnah is, is between the two. Ahl Sunnah is neither too extreme but they adhere to the principles of Kitab Allah wa Sunnah Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and the Minhaj of the Salaf of the Ummah, the methodology of the Salaf. Nor are they to the other extreme of being too easy to where they say, no, it's okay, so and so has Bid'ah, so and so has Kufr, we'll mix with them, we'll imitate them, we'll be with them, and we'll not distinguish ourselves from them. Absolutely not. Ahl Sunnah is in between and they stay away from those two extremes. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Kitabi al Kareem, وَكَذَلِكَ جَعَلْنَاكُمْ أُمَّةٍ وَاسَةٍ لِتَكُونُوا شُهَدَاءَ عَلَى النَّاسِ وَيُكُونُوا رَسُولُ عَلَيْكُمْ شَهِيدًا Allah tabarak wa ta'ala says in Kitab al Kareem, and likewise we have made you a nation in the middle, in the middle course, so that you would be a witness over mankind. And that the messenger would be a witness over you. Meaning that the Prophet Wasallam, he gave us the message of Islam. He made clear for us the meanings of the Quran. He made clear for us the Sunnah. And it is on us to follow it. And the Prophet Wasallam, he alayhi, made this clear for us and he is a witness over us. Not meaning that he is watching us as some of the people of, ex of extreme belief believe, but rather on the day of judgment, he will be asked about his nation. And he will be surprised at how far some of them had went away from the message, from the message of Islam, of true Islam. And so Ahlul Sunnah, in practicing this ayat, the Sheikh mentioned that Ahlul Sunnah is just. Ahlul Sunnah, they always move towards the truth and try to adhere to the truth. And Ahlul Sunnah is away from extreme, being extreme going beyond the bounds of the Sharia, whether that be in the bound, uh, going to the bounds of takfir, those people who declare other Muslims to be disbelievers without the right to do so, or whether those people are extreme in their, their worship, where they begin to worship the creation and make intercession with their saints, and intercession with their uh, sheikhs, and, intercessions with, uh, in, uh, and seek intercession from the dead. Those are two extremes. Ahl Sunnah is just. Ahl Sunnah is in the middle. Ahl Sunnah stays away from uh, being extreme. And instead they adhere to the haq. And rather they are balanced. So this is the ni'mah from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And may Allah bless us to be from Ahl Sunnah. And bless us to be balanced. And I ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Anything I said that was correct was from Allah. Anything I said that was incorrect was from myself and the shaitan. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.